Lesson 27, Optimization 2. An open cylindrical bin of radius r centimetres and capacity v cubic centimetres is to have a surface area of 1200 pi centimetres squared. In part 1, show that v equals pi r divided by 2 times 1200 minus r squared. Right, now in part 1, we need to be able to work out the surface area of the open bin. Now, if we take that bin, and we can see that we have one lid, or the base. Now this will be 2 pi r, because that's the circumference of the, uh, the circle. And this is the height of the bin. Okay, and this is the radius. So the area will be equal to 2 pi r h plus the area of the circle pi r squared. But we know that this is equal to 1200 pi. Dividing, taking the pi out and dividing both sides by pi, we get 2 r h plus r squared equals 1200. Therefore, we can see that 2 r h equals 1200 minus r squared. Therefore, h will be equal to 1200 minus r squared all over 2r, which equals, well, we'll leave it like that, and we can, now we've got the, what the height is, now the volume of, the, of a cylinder is equal to pi r squared h. So this will be pi r squared times this h, which is 1200 minus r squared all over 2r. And we can see by putting that 2r at the front here and cancelling that, we get pi r over 2 into 1200 minus r squared. And that's what was required. All right, now in part two, we have to find the maximum capacity of, of the bin. So we'll have to differentiate this uh, function, but I'll, re I'll remove, remove the brackets there, which will make it a little bit easier to um, differentiate. Uh, but I'll leave, I just might leave that pi up on two at the front. So I'll write this as v, v equals pi upon two, and we'll put that, take the r inside, that's 1200R minus R cubed. So we get dv dr is equal to pi upon 2 outside of 1200 minus 3R squared. Now if we take the second derivative, d2v dr squared, we get pi upon 2 outside of 0 minus, this becomes 6r, which of course is going to be minus 3 pi r. Now, if r is greater than 0, which it has to be because of the radius, then this will be always negative, so that means a maximum will have to occur. All right, so we'll let dv dr equal 0, so let dv the r equals 0, and we get pi upon 2 into 1200 minus 3r squared equals 0. That means that 3r squared must be equal to 1200. So that means that r squared, oops, r squared must be equal to 400 which means that R 
must be equal to square root of 400, which is 20. So R is positive, so now we've got a, a maximum capacity. So all we need now is to substitute that back into the formula. So we can see that V is equal to pi upon 2 outside of 1200 times 20 minus 20 cubed. I'll take up one of those 20s so that 20 comes out and becomes 10 pi outside of 1200. 20 squared is 400. So it becomes that's 800 and 800 times 10 is 8,000. So that's 8,000 pi centimeters cubed is the maximum capacity of the bin.